Good morning, my name is Denise DeShane Zook and I'm the Media Pass President from the Lake Orion Lions Club here in Lake Orion. Um, I'm very happy to be here today to talk about our club. Uh, the Lake Orion Lions have been in existence since 1938. So we had just celebrated our 85th anniversary, which is super, super exciting. And um, I wanted to just give you a little overview of what we do. Our motto is we serve and we serve through a number of different channels. We help individuals maybe with eyeglasses, hearing aids. We also collect eye, eyeglasses that we give to third world countries, which can be utilized again. We also sponsor the first robotics teams, both with the middle school and the high school. We also um, help with Little League, or um, we do high school scholarships, renewable scholarships for four years for the Lake Orion High School students. We um, sponsor a lake, the uh, Bear Lake Blind Camp, which is in Lapeer, which was started by Al Kassam, one of our uh, line members from many, many years ago. Um, one of the things that we're most proud about is our Christmas basket program. So our Christmas basket program runs about the second or third week in December. This year it will be on December 15th and 16th. And we provide Christmas baskets which include food, also includes perishable type items, and also includes gifts. And um, we set up at the Cirque Center for two days on December 15th and 16th. We gather a number of volunteers to build the baskets and then deliver the baskets. So the build day is December 15th, the delivery is December 16th. And um, that takes um, a great amount of revenue to make those Christmas baskets because we serve about 275 to 300 Lake Orion families and then we also serve about 80 senior citizens. So during the course of the year, we raise that money for the Christmas baskets. And one of the ways we do that is what is called our Christmas auction. During the course of the evening, with live auction, silent auction, raffles, cookie table, things like that, we'll raise the money, and that money will help us for our Christmas basket program. Um, when I became a lion, I became a lion when I saw the Christmas basket program. From that point on, I wanted to be a lion. And through the course of the year, we were out there in, in street collection, maybe the White Cane or Goodfellows, trying to raise money. We also have an event in the March or April of every year, which is called the Lion Races. So we take a wooden lion that's carved out and it has a name of a business on it. We'll have about 20 different businesses that have a lion. And again, another fundraiser of having lions go down the track just like a horse track uh, in order to raise money. Recently, we started a new program and it was uh, spearheaded by one of our members, Joanne Van Tassel, and that is called um, Books for, for Students in the Kindergarten and First Grade level. We sponsor two Lake Orion Elementary Schools and we just distributed um, several books. We were able to be on site at those schools and to have that in, those children have their own book to take home. Uh, we met with the students from all of the, all of the classrooms, handed out the books, and they were able to to uh, have a, a book that they could have home in their own library. We hope to do that program in the years to come as well. Um, if if a organization or a individual comes to us as lions, we work with them to try to help them. Maybe we need to try to help them get some uh, food or maybe we need to help them get a ramp built or something like that, the Lions finds the avenues to get that done. As far as the Lions are concerned, we have a new and revised great website. So you can go to the Lake Orion Lions website, find out about the people that are part of the organization, our sponsor organizations that help us each year, and a little bit more about what the Lions do. I'm very proud to be a Lake Orion Lion. I'm very proud to have just recently served as president of the Lions Club and as we continue to move forward to continue to serve the community.